my name is Melissa. Um, I'm a video producer for Reviewed, and today I'm gonna to be making bread in a stove Dutch oven. So um, here are the ingredients that we need for this bread. Um, it's pretty simple. It's just flour, kosher salt, water, and yeast. I have never made bread before. I don't know how yeast works. Oh, it's slippery. Oh God. It's like, like damp. So I cut it open and now it's like squishy. Magic. <laughs> That's the power of yeast right there. We have two cups of lukewarm water. It says 90 to 110 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah. We're now we're gonna put um, two and a quarter teaspoons of yeast in that and stir it until it gets foamy. Nothing's happening. Oh, it smells. Oh yeah, it doesn't smell good. I mix it up. And while we're waiting for it to foam, I'm gonna make the rest of the dough mixture. We're gonna put four cups of flour in a bowl. This is a very messy process. One and a half teaspoons of kosher salt. This is gonna go very badly. Okay, we're fine, this is fine. This is about one. Um, but yes, yeah, so now I have to mix the flour and the salt together by hand, so let's do that. Ooh, this is, uh, this is kinda nice. So then once I'm done mixing, I'm supposed to make a well. Ah! I spilled some. Push things out to the side a little bit. That's Welsh, I would say. Yeasty wetness. All right, I feel like this is gonna be really gross. Oh, I don't wanna do this. Oh, it's warm. Oh God. Uh oh, it's sticky. Oh God, no, oh, I'm hating this. <laughs> it's so sticky. Look at my finger. <laughs> Is it supposed to be this sticky? Oh! It's getting better. So the recipe says to do this by hand, but um, this would actually be really helpful if I had a KitchenAid stand mixer um, because then my hands wouldn't be covered in sticky goop right now. Okay, so it's a... Uh, it's mostly good. I'm still a little sticky, but I washed my hands. Maybe I'm overworking it, who knows? I don't know what overworking means. I don't know. Look at this boy, he's cute. He's adorable. I'm gonna name him Frederick. Look at him, beautiful. Check back in like an hour and a half, two hours. Um, so it's been about an hour um, since I last left my doe, Frederick, um, alone. He's risen quite a bit, um, as you can see. He's quite chunky. The recipe says to give him a few pokes to see if he's done. <laughs> I feel like I shouldn't play with it too much because doing this alone is making him sink a lot. Why are you so sticky? I'm gonna put new saran wrap on top of my dough, Frederick, and let it sit for another hour and a half to two hours and we'll go from there. about an hour and a half since um, we last checked in on Frederick, our dough. Very sticky boy. Now I'm gonna flour some things. Flour some things. Because he's really sticky, I'm gonna use quite a bit. Yeah, buddy. Now I'm getting the ends off. Nice. <laughs> I am supposed to flour my hands this time, which I've forgotten every other time. So I'm gonna do that. Pretend like I'm washing my hands with some flour. More flour, the better. I'm not gonna bake ever again. Now I'm gonna just fold this into a loaf shape and then make some seams and kind of just form it into what I think a bread should look like. It's like it's like dough. Like he's not sticky anymore. Um, I need to transfer him to a bowl, but first the bowl needs to be coated in like olive oil and some flour. So I can do that. A clean paper towel to kind of like to coat the bowl, you know, mm-hmm, gross. Now I'm gonna lightly coat that in some flour. And I just sprinkle that in there. I, I got this. Do I just, do I just plop it? <laughs> yeah, cool, so now I'm gonna cover that and let that sit for an hour. And then we're gonna um, prep the Dutch oven now. So while we're waiting for the bread to have its final rise, we're gonna put the stove Dutch oven in the oven. Basically, while the oven preheats to 450, the Dutch oven will also preheat. So then when the bread gets put in the Dutch oven, it will cook, theoretically. So it's been about 45 minutes. The dough has risen. 
Yeah, look at this. Like, this is a dough. Like, I'm gonna, look at that. What, what? Smiley face. That's gonna show up in the bread? Yeah. <gasps> Frederick. <laughs> so now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go into the preheated oven that is now at 450 degrees. And I'm going to take out the stove Dutch oven and put it up here, take the lid off, dump Frederick in my bread. Um, Put it back in, call it a day. All right, let's do this. Oh my God, look at that bad boy. This is the side that had the olive oil. So I'm gonna put that side up because that makes sense, maybe. I'm gonna lift him up, plop him in there. I feel like it's not gonna go well. All right, we have family photo. Okay, so here we go. Wow, that was like perfect landing. So now the bread is in the hot Dutch oven and I am going to put the lid back on. See you later, buddy. And I'm gonna put him in the oven and bake him for 45 minutes and then we'll eat him. Bye bye, Frederick. About like 15 minutes ago, I took the lid off of the stove Dutch oven um, because that's what the directions said. I forgot to mention that earlier. 30 minutes in there with the lid on and then 15 minutes with it off at the end. I've seen them do this in the Great British Baking Ship. I'm a professional. Ooh, he didn't stick. Here he is. <gasps> Ta-da! He's a bread. Yeah, so this is Frederick, my bread. He's a little thumpy, which is nice. Um, he's got some like squish to him, which is kind of cool. He's got um, little cuts here and there. He's got some flour, which I think is nice. Um, add some character. That's, that's fun. Let's cut into him and see what he looks like inside. No, he's my son. I'm gonna cut him. <laughs> ah, bada boom. Look at him, he's squishy. Oh, that's hot. Oh, that's hot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop doing that. No, I'm not. I'm gonna keep doing that. It's pretty squishy. It's got some holes in it. I don't know if that's good. Oh, he's got like a big hole right there. Wait, I'm gonna eat him. Yeah, I guess that's pretty good. Um, I'm pretty, pretty proud of him. Uh, it's really nice, really beautiful. Um, I would say it was not worth the seven hours it took to make him. I mean, it's pretty big, but like, I, it's not gonna, I could eat him faster than I made him. So that's depressing. Yeah, I made bread. Woo. Oh, he's got a butt. <laughs> it's got a butt. <laughs>